atrophies, diabetes, liver disease, autism, periodontal disease, and Alzheimer's. Now, the, one of the first colleges to do on their own research on protandum was Harvard University in Boston, studying Duchenne's muscular dystrophy, and proved in our first clinical paper, and you can, I'll tell you how to find that, that it would do a reversal of Duchenne's, which has been a deadly disease of little boys dying usually between 12 and 14 years of age. What really works when you're dealing with free radicals? Well, direct antioxidants is a one-on-one, -on -one, like one part of antioxidant will neutralize one part of free radical, period. You can say milligram for milligram if you want it. That's a direct antioxidant. Now, the only indirect antioxidant is protandum, but it works in a little bit different way, a higher magnitude. It's one per one million, per second, every second, for 13 days. I'll repeat that. Protandum eradicates free radicals one million per second, every second, for 13 days. How many free radicals does your body produce every day? Well, I'm glad you asked. We produce so many that to completely eliminate them with a direct antioxidant, with juices and fruits, vitamins, blueberries, here's what you would have to consume every day. 87 glasses of red wine, 375 oranges, 11 pounds of blueberries, or 120 vitamin C tablets, 15, 500 milligrams each, and every day to neutralize the amount of free radicals your body produces every single day. Okay? Here's my answer. How many free radicals do we produce every day in our bodies? 300 with 21 zeros. It's called 300 sextillion. Now, you can see why you must have an antioxidant that deals in the realm of protandum. One million free radicals neutralized per second, every second, for 13 days. And the next day, you'll make that much more. And so you take a pill, one a day, every day, is what you use. So, direct antioxidants versus indirect. Fact, direct antioxidants do not effectively neutralize free radicals or lower oxidation in the body. They do not effectively neutralize free radicals or lower oxidation in the body. So we cross that one out, and here it is. Protanum is the only supplement clinically proven to reduce oxidative stress by an average of 40%, slowing down the cell aging to the level of a 20-year-old. While conventional or direct antioxidants can neutralize only one free radical molecule per molecule, protandum triggers the creation of enzymes that can each eliminate over a million free radicals per second without being used up, per second, every second, for 13 days. You see, folks, that's why this is important. That's why this is going to change the way you feel if you allow it. Now, we have only one product in two forms. One, we have a tablet. Two, we have a cream. And this is a wonderful cream. And this has been proven by a published paper from Louisiana State University with the research they had done on skin cancer. This will remove skin cancer. And I can say that because it's published. If you have an argument with me, please just go to bigbluecalendar.com and pull up that LSU article and you have an argument with them. That's what they say. Utilizes proven benefits of protandum. It's a cream with protandum. Fights radical damage to the skin. 
noticeably diminished his fine lines and deep wrinkles. I've never seen anybody ask me how they could get more of those. Stimulates skin renewal, collagen, and elastin production. Lightens age spots, you know those big brown spots, and balances pigmentation. Increases skin smoothness and motor, moisture, moisturization. Dermatological tested. Dr. Kimberly Stone, MD in Denver, a dermatologist, uses this in her practice. Now, here's some results. This lady has got a few wrinkles here, yawn, and everywhere. Here's 60 days later. I don't know whether you can see the difference, but she was sure happy. And here's another one. Now, these little crevices are kind of like mine. You know, something you put in there, take a trowel to cover them up with an ointment or a cream. But look at here, 56 days later, moisture's been reinstated, collagen and elastin has been reinstated in this face. My wife uses this instead of makeup now and has for about four months. You know, it's different. Here's Kimberly Stone's comment. True science is different in formulating true science. She was in on it. She made the recommendations for the base. We took the best ingredients from different successful products and then added several of the main components of Protandum to develop a very unique product. There are many, many anti-aging creams out there that contains antioxidants, but none, none that have the powerful combination True Science has. I'm excited about the potential I see with this True Science. She said once that she uses them in about 80% of the patients she sees. Now here's something about the formulator, Dr. Joe McCord. I've met with him a couple of times. In 1968, a highlight of Duke University Medical School when Dr. Erwin Fredovich and graduate student Joe McCord discover the enzyme which protects all living things against the toxicity of oxygen. Dr. McCord helped launch the study of antioxidants in 1969. Co-discovered free radical biology, nominated four times for the Nobel Prize in Medicine, received the Elliott Crescent Medal in 1997. In fact, the last recipient that has been given to was Dr. Joe McCord. And why was he given that? For discovering the biology of free radical reactions in living organisms. He's now professor of medicine at the University of Colorado. And I might add, Duke University had their centennial this May, 100 years as a medical school. And they listed the five most outstanding accomplishments of that 100-year tenure of Duke University School of Medicine. One of the five was Dr. Joe McCord and his mentor, Irvin Fredovich, and their discovery of superoxide desmutase. One of the five outstanding things Duke University did in their 100 years was his discovery of superoxide desmutase. Okay? L.A. Crescent Award is here. But I'll show you some other people that also have won this. You might know of Marie and Pierre Curie, Wilbur and Orville Wright, Alexander Graham Bell, Henry Ford for the assembly line. What would we do without the assembly line? And Joe McCord. Now, here's a little study that was done by 30 labs, each separate, testing the T-bars, that's thiobartrate, and a 20-year-old level, a 40-year-old, 60, and an 80-year-old. But if you give each one of these people protandum for 30 days, like we're doing here, here's the result, the T-bars are down at the same level as the 20-year-old. Folks, I ask you, join me in a quest to help people slow down their aging and put more life in their years instead of just years in their life. We've got too much of that. I used to go to 11 nursing homes in Kansas City because I had a compassion 
for all people. Now I am one. But I know now that I can cut down my aging. And that's what I'm all about today. We have four patents. These patents were issued 07, 08, 09, and 11. And they're composition patents, alleviating oxidative stress in mammals, composition alleviating oxidative stress in mammals. This is a different one than this one. And this was different than all of them. And if you want to really read exciting reading, and I'm not being facetious, you want to read these patents because they tell you everything the Britannum was tested on. It's magnanimous. Partial list of studies in the medical field. These are all schools that are now doing research at their own expense on Protandum. They're that excited about it. Here's University of Michigan. I believe Michigan State is also here, but I'm not sure it's on this list. Ohio State, University of Minnesota, Virginia Commonwealth, Vanderbilt, University of Florida, Harvard, Louisiana State. Now, folks, you may think that this is just another supplement. But you've never seen this with a supplement ever, ever before. Denver Health Medical Center, University of Colorado, University of Michigan, University of Kentucky. There's 29 scientific studies of Protandum underway at leading research institutions, 29 medical schools, involving the most serious of all health conditions. And we get these publications, of which we now have nine, as soon as the studies are complete. Join me in helping people feel a better life at their age. 